Hello, Jody, Mark Alderman from Alderman Chevrolet Buick GMC, Vermont's favorite car dealership. Jody, thanks for inquiring about this 2023 Buick Enclave Essence. Underneath the hood, 3.6 liter V6 engine, puts out 310 horsepower and 266 foot-pounds of torque, married to a super smooth nine-speed automatic transmission. Up front, you've got the iconic Buick uh, front grille here, very premium in appearance. Large LED signature daytime running lights, lower LED projector headlamps with that are automatic brights. Then you've got 20 inch polished aluminum wheels right there. Now, this has an all wheel drive platform that's front wheel drive first, all wheel drive second, and so. I'm going to say that uh, in my uh, my wife and I, we've had uh, at least two Buick uh, Enclaves. And I'll tell you that when you put snow tires all the way around on this vehicle, this is the best uh, handling or best performing all-wheel drive in the snow bar none. Uh, this vehicle served our family very, very well uh, in snow time winter driving. Um, now you've got some accent lighting on the mirrors here. Each one of the doors has a passive button, passive lock button here. As long as the key fob's in my pocket, you can unlock and unlock the doors from each one of those buttons. Here in the back, capless fuel filler system. Great uh, because you don't have to get your hands dirty to release the gas cap, but also you don't have that cap dangling here where it can scratch the paint. Give you another view here led rear tail lamps these improve the car uh, uh, make the car more visible um, especially in low visibility conditions now i love this uh, with the silver accents on this white uh, works very well with the chrome so you see there's silver accents down below and then the chrome accents on the door handles and the lower body edge there and then that silver accent comes up and you've got the dual rear exhaust is just a very sculpted rich design on the Buick Enclave you've got an integrated rear spoiler here that combined with the rear wiper keeps the rear window nice and clean deep tinted rear glass looks really sharp just love the lines how they flow here into the rear quarter and then you've got this kind of gullwing design there on that rear window looks very sharp inside Beautiful premium interior, two-tone with a lighter gray with dark ebony accents. The seats, premium leather uh, perforated here on the touch points. Uh, this has middle row captain's chairs. Um, the rear seat's easily accessible. You can fold the seat down. You can access it through the middle here. You can lift up this rear portion, um, and uh, it, but it's a full seven passenger vehicle and then these seats also slide um, and so you give you just a different perspective there of the different amounts of knee room that that can provide you and even with the seat all the way up still an adequate amount of knee room with the driver's seat back in a driving position um, and this seat all the way forward and to give you an idea of the change in knee room here in the back see this this is pretty adequate right here over here on this other side with the seat all the way back uh, it's pretty tight now this is the other reason i like the captain's chairs so you can kind of stretch out in this middle back seat go buffalo bills um and then this is this is pretty tight back here so I have to be a smaller person than myself now, up front, the sculpted design outside continues inside. You see this dual cockpit interior with the flowing lines here. So you've got the um, kind of a wood-like accent with some metallic trim, soft touch materials throughout, large infotainment screen. Just a very beautiful design. Large center console here. Um, it's got the electronic precision shift, which I can tell you from using it, love it. Um, hidden cup holders there, wireless charging, 
And then one of my favorite features on a vehicle, this actually has two moonroofs. I'll go back to the third row here and give you a view here. So you've got the larger front op uh, moonroof that opens or uh, tilts. And then the fixed glass moonroof here in the back. Both have power uh, shades that you can close from up front. Whoops, banged my head there. So let's take a closer look at the interior. And inside we're greeted with some welcome animations that work together here the, on the uh, infotainment screen in the driver information center. Push button start. Now I mentioned the all-wheel drive. Um, one of the things that used to be full-time all-wheel drive, but now um, you can um, be just front-wheel drive and then use press this button and you're, and you're into all-wheel drive there. Um, this has Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. Um, and then Waze navigation is a real popular feature here with either one. And it has available 4G LTE Wi-Fi. Up front here, you've got USB, A, and C ports. Um, here's the hidden cup holders I mentioned. Consoles, nice and large. You got a removable tray here and then much deeper down below there. And just, you know what, it's a minor point, but you also have where the seat belts adjust on the um, pillar there. So, um, it just helps, you know, if a seatbelt's more comfortable overall, just improves the experience. These seats are absolutely incredible. Sculpted out, really, you know, very significant bolsters here on the sides, just improve the comfort overall in this car. Now we can, uh, we can raise and lower the lift gate from here if we wanted to. Uh, by the way, I meant to mention this has an eight-way power seat with a two-way power lumbar control. Step it back here with the key fob. So we've got remote start programmed into the key fob. You can also use your phone and basically start your car from California if you wanted to. But with the phone, where that's really come in handy, two things that jump out at me. Uh, skiing, uh, that last run of the day. I'm going to put the zoom back here. That last run of the day, I'll flip out my phone and start my car from the top of the ski lift so it's nice and warm when I get down. Or flying back from someplace in the winter, you ride back late um, and you want to get your car started and warmed up. So I'm going to use the key fob here to raise the back. And this third row seat here is a 60-40 split. So the larger part on the driver's side here. And then you saw how the middle captain's chairs fold down nice and flat. So these all come down nice and easy. So depending on your combination of people and cargo, lots of solutions here. Um, and uh, then you've got some hidden storage that's all finished off here. Um, and the amount of room in this car is extraordinary. In fact, when our kids we're in car seats. Uh, we used to try and rent an Enclave or a Traverse, um, and occasionally they would give us a Suburban or a Tahoe. And frankly, with car seats, uh, there's not as much space in a Suburban or Tahoe um, and luggage as there is with the Buick Enclave or Chevrolet Traverse, uh, which are similar. The Enclave's a little bit longer. Um, so here's another view of it there. So Jody, this is the 2023 Buick Enclave Essence. If you'd like to learn more, just click the learn more button below. Or if you're on YouTube, there's a link in the description. Or come see it for yourself at Alderman Chevrolet Buick GMC, Route 7 South in Rutland.